Welcome to this video on creating Valentines in Corel Paint Shop Pro. Creating unique Valentine card sheets with original messages can be fun for the whole family and is sure to be a hit in the classroom. In this tutorial we will show you how easy this project can be. First, open Paint Shop Pro and make sure that the Edit tab is active. In the New Image dialog box, you can choose the size for the cards. In this example, we'll use the standard wallet size, which is 2.5 by 3.5 inches, and set the resolution to 300 dpi. Next, click on the check mark to remove transparency, and then click inside the color swatch. From the Pattern section, we can choose the appropriate background. Click OK, and then OK again to continue. Now that the background is in place, let's bring in a photograph. Open the image, and then go to Selections and choose Select All. Next, from the Edit menu, choose Copy. Alternatively, you can use the key combination control and the letter C on your keyboard. Click on your project, and then from the Edit menu, select Paste as New Layer. Zoom out and resize by dragging the nodes on the corners of the image. Common to Valentine's is the mood or speech bubble. To insert a bubble, click on the Preset Shape tool in the standard toolbar. On the Tool Options palette, click the arrow beside the Shape List icon to select a shape. You can drag and position it over the image and it will appear as its own layer. To add text, click on the Text tool. Make sure to click away from the mood bubble and then add the text. Next, drag the text over top of the bubble. To recolor highlighted text, make sure that the Materials palette is open. Left-click to change the outline color, and right-click to change the fill color. To dress this up a little more, there is a large selection of picture tubes that come free with PaintShop Pro. Choose the Picture Tube tool from the standard toolbar. Click the arrow next to the Picture Tube list icon on the Tool Options palette. In this example, we'll select one of the sets of hearts. Next, place a few around the edges. If you don't like a picture tube once you've placed it, you can remove it easily by going to the Edit menu and selecting Undo. Or, use the key combination Control and the letter Z on your keyboard. If you don't like the style or size, you can change those options easily at the top of your screen. To print your own sheet of nine valentines, go to File, and then select Print. Click on the Template tab, and check Print to Template. Click Select Template. Now the preview will display how the sheet will look once it's been printed. Depending on what brand of printer you're using, it may be recommended that you select the style of paper when printing to gloss or semi-gloss cardstock. To check your printer settings, click on the Properties button at the top of the print window prior to printing. To save a version of your project that can be altered at a later time, be sure to save it as a PSP image file. This way, your layers will remain intact. To save a version that can be printed later or sent via email, go back to the File menu, choose Save As, and select JPEG. Since JPEG images can only hold a single layer, you will get a warning message. Click Yes to this message to continue. Thank you for watching this video on creating Valentines in Corel Paint Shop Pro.